All right, we're going to try and squeeze a little bit more juice out of Turtle Pack. Uh, there was an update on Monday this week, which changed, I think, four pets in this pack. Uh, they gave one extra attack to Hedgehog. They flipped uh, the turkey um, buffs around so it gives more attack instead of health. They increased Whale's base stats and they reworked Hippo slightly. So not really anything that's going to drastically change the builds that you're running in this pack. Kind of wild that there were no nerfs to Turtle Pack at all. <laughs> Which, when all the other packs had nerfs, especially uh, Star Pack. But um, I'm sure some of those will, will come about eventually. Probably Mouse is one of those pets that's going to get changed, but... For now, everything remains the same. Uh, this run was obviously recorded before the patch anyway, so you can see there it's only a 3-2 Hedgehog. And I, it's kind of weird to be commentating this thinking that I was trying to come up with something different in Turtle Pack when I'm playing for Elephant Blowfish. And I, I would love to see like a breakdown of stats of the most popular teams uh, in Turtle Pack because I feel like Elephant Blowfish and Elephant Camel must be one and two. Um, maybe that's just personal bias from having played against them so many times, but uh, they definitely seem to be very popular. So I wanted to try and iterate on Elephant Blowfish and come up with something that was uh, slightly out of the ordinary. And not too long ago I did a video on, um, I think I called it Start of Battle Crane. So the idea was to have Whale swallow a hedgehog and therefore trigger the crane at the start of battle. So I want to do that in Turtle Pack. We're going to have Elephant Blowfish and then have Whale swallowing a hedgehog so that it's going to set off the blowfish at the start of battle. And then we'll probably look for Wolverine to both boost the hedgehog and boost the blowfish. And yeah, here we go. Here's an elephant camel. So uh, I can't remember exactly how many of each type of opponent I face here. Although, to be honest, because we're going to be looking to use hedgehog and uh, Wolverine as well, we're probably more likely to end up in the kind of draw uh, vortex. So um, at that point, opposing teams are probably more likely to be to be elephant blowfish or something anyway. I guess not just elephant blowfish, but any kind of permutation of elephant, camel, blowfish, hedgehog with mushroom and so on. So uh, here we find the whale and I'm going to get it going straight away even though generally having whale at the back is uh, pretty bad news for for any build. But we're going to do it anyway. And we'll freeze another whale. And the double garlic, because we know that the uh, everything is going to get hit at the start of battle by the hedgehog. So garlic melon is basically uh, useless. Um, it's only going to block one damage uh, or two damage from the hedgehog. And then we'll uh, we'll look to garlic the whale, garlic the blowfish as well. Um, we're going to tie here because the hedgehog gets spit out at the end. Uh, there are some edits in this video because I guess I was tabbing in and out of the game quite a lot. So um, some of the uh, draw uh, ending screens go on forever and I've uh, tried to uh, cut that down as much as possible. We really need uh, stronger scaling than just a single level one giraffe though. We do kill the deer here and uh, the bus is going to trigger the blowfish again. So we got pretty decent value out of our very low statted blowfish. However, the opposing one here uh, is, has been scaled up uh, much higher and um, yeah, we can't uh, get over that wall. But level 2 elephant is definitely going to help. And I think I go for the elephant first. Dragon, we can't really use that. We don't have the space. Uh, we have already committed to the... I suppose I could sell Hedgehog and then just have Whale Swallow Dragon or something, but to be honest, I didn't think I really needed extreme scaling on this team other than on the Elephant. Um, you know, the, the combination is so good. There's a reason people run it. And here's an opposing Elephant Blowfish. And we're going to get some uh, a, a, an abbreviated uh, bit of Blowfish Tennis there. The fact that Blowfish does extra damage now, the fact that, you know, it moving up a tier doesn't really make any difference, I don't think. Uh, the damage is just so good. And we level into Tiger here. Normally you would just take Tiger and put it behind 
Blowfish, but I really want Wolverine. Uh, although I think uh, when we first buy it, the Wolverine is going to kill itself because it's going to boost the Hedgehog. But we just want to be as disruptive as possible at the start of battle. And I also just don't like Tiger. I think I've mentioned that many times before. I think this time um, it's going to be a draw again because the Hedgehog is only uh, level 1. Uh, actually, I guess the, it's level 2, but it's level 1 coming out of the Whale. Really need a level up on the Blowfish. Only a level 1 Blowfish at, level, at uh, turn 11 is pretty weak. And here I take the Mammoth Mushroom just so that I can uh, pill it to scale a little bit more widely. I would like the Hedgehog to have higher stats so that it doesn't get um, sniped by level 2 Dolphin. And uh, a fellow Whale team. Uh, of course, putting the Mammoth in the middle does mean that I'm missing out on a lot of stats during the battle. But actually, uh, here it gives us enough so that we trade and then we end up tying with the bus as well. So you can clearly see the difference. You know, I think if you're just playing Elf and Blowfish normally, you're probably just going to win a lot of turns. Uh, whereas now we are uh, tying. And we get the level 2 Mammoth with the Mushroom, so I can pill it and then immediately have another Mammoth, which will also uh, draw Dolphin Snipes, which is nice. Another Elf and Blowfish team. And they're going for a uh, 1-up Blowfish, which is something that in previous versions of the game didn't really make a whole lot of sense, but now you know, if a 1-1 uh, Blowfish comes back to life, it's still going to deal, uh, the level 2 Blowfish is going to do a 6 damage snipe. Yeah, it was reduced to 4 there because of the garlic. So we can pill the Mammoth again. I can't remember if I wait for the Mushroom or not. Um, maybe, I don't think I've passed a Wolverine either. And there we go, there's the Wolverine. So I think I'm probably just going to pill the Mammoth now and bring Wolverine in. Although, like I said, it's only going to uh, initially, it's only going to affect the first uh, snipe from the Blowfish and the uh, initial Hedgehog Blast. However, that is going to be good enough to kill the Monkey on the opposing team there. And then we get multiple activations because the uh, Leopard had Chili and the Camel refilling the health on the um, Rabbit doesn't really make any difference. So we'll one-up the Wolverine so that when it comes back it can affect the blowfish if it doesn't get sniped. And then we're also going to one up the hedgehog just for more uh, chaos. And okay, we do end up with the uh, the hedgehog getting sniped there, so the wolverine got swallowed. But I don't think it's going to make any difference because when it comes back as a 1 1, it's still going to affect the blowfish. To be honest, I don't think the snipe damage there actually mattered at all. And now it's just a case of looking for the last chocolate on the elephant. And I, I mean, I guess we can look for more levels on Blowfish and uh, Wolverine, but to be honest, I feel like this is going to be good enough. Now here's a pretty heavily scaled uh, food build. Going to be difficult to uh, to get past them. And of course, after the initial barrage, the, the Wolverine isn't going to affect the next Hedgehog um, attack. So yeah, okay, we're 20 health away from there, but... Um, uh, relatively close considering the size of that opposing team compared to our stats. So level 2 Wolverine, and then we'll just buy the salad. The melon doesn't really do anything for us. Opposing <laughs> Elephant Blowfish again, but this is a proper Elephant Blowfish team in inverted commas, which just has the tiger. And I think a lot of people have mentioned this, that as much fun as Wolverine can be, it's certainly in customs. Um, you know, the tiger is generally just a lot better. However, in that particular game, because we had the whale at the back, we end up winning instead of drawing. I thought that was pretty amusing. Uh, no point going for level 3 hedgehog now. And 9 wins. It's another scaling team with the, the classic level 1 mosquito, but mosquito is not going to do anything against the blowfish team. Um, we, uh, look at the amount of damage there that the Blowfish does, it's just absolutely obscene. And again, the Whale is going to kill the last unit and the Hedgehog is going to pop out for the win. So a little bit of a twist on a very popular build. And uh, there is one other build that I have in mind for pack 1 that I've been working on. So um, hopefully I'll have that one done soon.